Hi Leo, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to another Love Bite. Leo, let's see what are the messages here for you now. And a warm welcome back to all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. All right, Leo. Spirit, give me three cards for the first person. Six of Cups, uh, Three of Swords in Reverse and the Three of Pentacles. Second person, Knight of Cups, Eight of Cups in Reverse and the Four of Swords in Reverse. Okay, uh, Mutual Energies, the Empress in Reverse, Nine of Cups Upright and the Justice card. Bottom of my deck, the Tower in Reverse. I have a feeling one of you wants to rebuild now. The other person is saying, well, the tower already happened. It's over for me. Uh, uh, just looking at the cards, I mean, newcomers, okay, remember this. The first line is person A for me. Second line is person B. You could be either one of them, right? If this is a, your reading, of course. So from first person A's uh, energy I'm getting, this person is really missing the other person. They feel that, we were meant to be together. I want to go back to them. I want to bring back the happy times. I want to uh, do something which can make, make them forget all the hurt that has been caused by me or the, the situation. They want to work things out. The second person, person B for me, I think they are more inclined towards uh, maybe moving on to maybe new love or something. They are no longer putting in any work into this past person uh, they are not even waiting around actually they, they've kind of erased that out of their mind they've, they're not waiting for this person to come back because well we'll check why anyways um, i'm going to clarify all these cards for you leo and then to do your mutual energies as well but uh, before that i'm going to take some dialogue message cards let's see if you guys could say something to each other what that would be and then i'll clarify the rest leo and that person spirit Leo and their person, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Leo and their person, spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? All right, and just a few more from a third deck as well, Leo, and then we'll start the reading. Leo and their person, spirit. Leo. All right, good to go. Let's start the reading. And Leo, if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is omkarataro at gmail.com. You can reach me there. It's there in the description box below as well. So the first card here says, My feelings for you were deeper than I could admit. I was only seeking others in order to help me forget, get over you. Okay, this could be the second person who's now trying to find new love. I'm only seeking others in order to help me get over you. I can envision us getting back together again in the future. You really were the best thing that's ever happened in my life. I should have listened to my intuition. Deliver me from temptation. I wish I could have loved you the way you deserved to be loved. You just would not understand what I'm going through. Most days, I don't even understand. You say that I'm your divine true love and that I'm always on your mind. I don't understand that how you could have then ghosted, ignored and even blocked me so much over the years. There are times when you've denied my very existence so much that I felt the pain might only end if I no longer existed. Our separation has destroyed me. There are times when I haven't wanted to live. I would, I've often wondered if you would even notice if I no longer existed. My mind is racing and my doubts are my, my heart is breaking with the doubts and insecurities your inconsistent behavior has created. I just crave inner peace right now. My soul just feels unsettled. All right. So these were some of your messages, uh, Leo. If these were resonating with your storyline, let's start this reading. 
with uh, an angel blessing card and this one is going to be leo for the viewer now because you could be watching maybe your cross watcher is so a uh, blessing guidance advice or a message for the person watching the reading and we get the card of confidence so this has a dual meaning of course confidence probably means you need the confidence to stand up for yourself but also this is the strong sword of archangel michael it's given sometimes to sever ties with the toxic situations sometimes toxic people patterns habits so see what you can do with it okay spirit let's start the reading let's start with person a's energy and then we'll move to the second line which is person b for me you could be either one of them so six of cups person a what's the six of cups oh they are they are ready for commitment <laughs> they want to, to have a total transformation of this connection and they want to come back and i think this person is ready for uh, commitment now uh, three of swords in reverse yeah they don't want any other option now if this person was had a lot of options or they were not choosing they've made up their mind this person is, is has decided this is this is the one this is the one i want to have a future with yeah this person is ready absolutely ready to step up and bring that engagement ring and saying you know i want to be there for you forever and ever after let's forget about the past hurts and betrayals or whatever happened let's find peace together again uh, they are a little, they are a very embarrassed i think this person is very embarrassed and ashamed maybe they put the other person into third parties or something but now now they are missing that person it's like now the void is there because maybe they were getting all their energy from the other person right now they're feeling abandoned they're feeling lost they're feeling uh, i realize that you know whatever happened was unfair so three of pentacles three of pentacles yeah they're hoping to work things out they're hoping to work things out they're hoping that things can move forward in a positive direction again the other person spirit how is the other person feeling right now knight of cups what's the knight of cups yeah person b is getting impatient with the situation i feel they feel you know what it's time for me maybe now to step up my life maybe move on towards new love uh, they didn't put in the work they didn't come back they didn't put in the work uh, they didn't um, you know try and heal the situation with me so i i feel i feel maybe it's time for me to release this connection it's been stagnant for too long how long am i going to wait how long will i be the one trying all the time and um, i'm exhausted now tired i'm tired of waiting wondering uh, you know are they coming back are they not coming back no i'm not waiting for them anymore uh, four of swords in reverse four of swords in reverse one more yes they are uh, putting up strong boundaries now you know i need to now take back my life i'm allowing this tower to fall it's done i've lost faith i've lost hope in this connection i'm releasing this toxic situation so well mutual energy spirit for the person who's now ready one who is hoping that things can work out between the two of you well this person they're not very sure that the other person wants them back they know that they disrespected their person and now they feel maybe they don't even love me anymore the love is lost what if they've already turned their back on me here i am you know now understanding that they are the ones who make all my dreams and wishes come true now i've understood that this is my four of wands but what if they they don't want me back anymore so they are expecting the worst kind of karma somewhere justice in reverse yeah they feel they they they, are, they feel very very sad and bad and discontent because they know that if they get rejected now they would lose out on a big cup of love okay what about the other person who actually has been waiting but now is on the verge of you know saying i'm giving up i'm fed up of the waiting i need to move on towards new love that person spirit what do these three cards mean for that person yeah they are saying i wasn't nurtured i wasn't given my due respect there was nothing to look forward to there was no future so obviously you know i had to make a decision sooner or later 
So I have made my choice. I am now trying to make all my own dreams and wishes come true. I didn't get the 10 of cups with them. So 9 cups are still mine, right? So I am focusing on my own 9 cups and trying to make my own dreams and wishes come true. Because, uh, well, they didn't do anything to heal my broken heart. I've been doing it by myself. So I'm not investing any more energy, effort into a situation or a person where they were just being unfair to me. This was not a balanced connection. Justice in reverse. Yeah, justice in reverse is clarified by the justice in reverse. So person B is absolutely dead sure that there's no coming back from this. So tell me about the tower in reverse spirit. I think this is person A who is wanting to rebuild. They are still holding on to that hope. This person is still holding on to, to that hope because now they, it's now that they've recognized that none of their other options are what they want. The only option they want is the one that's missing. Uh, tower in reverse spirit. Tower in reverse. Yep, they have had the clarity spirit says. They've had the clarity now that they are losing out because of all these games that they played. They disrespected the person who was actually meant to be their lifelong partner. Now, yes, they are hoping and wishing that the chapter hasn't shut down or will get a new chance or something. But uh, I don't know. This person is a little scared is going to backfire as well. What if the other person doesn't want them back, doesn't want to work on the situation with them? So, yeah, they are going through the dark night of the soul right now. Uh, even if they are hoping, wishing, trying for a second chance, they are not sure if the other person would even want them back. So that's what's going on. Till next time then, Leo, love and light. Take care. Namaste.